nice kill right there, uh, is, you know, if you're squatted up, more than two people, if you've got three people in a squad, you're going to be thrown against full squads of maxed out players. Hey there, it's Big Tony up here at Nat G, coming at you with a little War Robots action. We are here, we are on the carrier map, and this is Beacon Rush, and we're starting off with my Dagon, and we're going to, uh, we're just going to see what kind of carnage and mayhem we can cause today. Um, we do have, uh, in 9.6 coming up, the new friend system, which should make squatting very, very interesting. Um, we'll give you kind of my first thoughts on it before, uh, you know, before we get a chance really to uh, test it out and get a good rip. Uh, I think it's going to be a good thing, however, it's going to make for some interesting matchmaking, because I already know I'm going to have people that are going to be friending me or sending me friend requests who have hangers that are probably significantly lower than mine as far as power output and bot levels, pilot levels, things of that nature. And what happens in the current matchmaking system, there's a nice kill right there, uh, is, you know, if you're squatted up, more than two people, if you've got three people in a squad, you're going to be thrown against full squads of maxed out players. And what's going to happen is a lot of folks who are going to be like an expert league, maybe even lower master league, are going to squat up and they're going to get absolutely pasty hammered by a whole bolt. Let's get this guy he's coming in. Boom. <laughs> yeah, you're better off just landing out in the ocean there, pal. Um, they're going to come into full contact with some of these big S-ranked maxed out clans. And it's going to be kind of demoralizing. That's what I think. Uh, for as good as, the, as it is to be able to do friends and do things with your friends in games, uh, it's, I think, going to get very, very interesting how the matchmaking is going to adapt to it. Okay, let's go ahead and give some love here. I'm going to bring out my Ochikochi. Let's see if we can't shove this guy off the boat. Oh, hopefully I don't go off the boat. Yep, there he goes. Goodbye, catfish. You are out of here. He's sleeping with the fishies out there. Okay, let's go ahead and push our way up towards the uh, far end of the map. Let's go ahead and go right to their spawn point if we can. That's what the Ocho is good for. But that's kind of my first impressions of this whole new friend system. Um, it would have been so much better and so much more useful if that would have been deployed, you know, like five years ago, maybe six years ago. Back when the game was had a lot more people in it than it does right now. And it, it, I think it might be a day late and a dollar short. That's, that's, what, that's the phrase that keeps bumping my head when it talks about that. These quality of life issues should have been addressed years and years ago. And maybe we wouldn't have some of the issues we have today as far as, you know, people bailing, people disappearing, uh, the game having rapid turnover. And of course, at one point in time, this game, I, you know, was kind of pushing towards, let's be an eSport. And that's just not the business model and the approach that was taken here. So, uh, we'll have to wait and see. Um, when and if people start shooting me friend requests, I'm going to have to kind of put a limit on it as far as, you know, you're going to have to be in Champion League. You're going to have to have at least MK2 level 8 plus gear. Uh, otherwise, if you match make with me, if you friend up with me and we hop into some random matches, you're going to get hammered. You're going to end up in some high-end matches and it's going to just get brutal. Kind of like right up here. This is kind of some... This is kind of some tricky bombardier type destruction right here. And if your bot can't handle it, it it's not going to make your time running with me very fun. So uh, we'll see what the other YouTubers do as well when they set up their, you know, their new friends lists. And I'm really looking forward to it because, you know, I, I've had lots and lots of friends in the past and I used to uh, associate my Facebook page with this. Come on, come on, there we go, it's a Titan Slayer. But... Uh, I made no, did an about face on social media. I only let my Facebook, my real Facebook uh, page, not page, my Facebook account, I don't associate with the game. That is for friends, very close friends and family only. And I do have a Facebook page, but you can't use that to link up for friends. And we'll just launch Diego out there. Now we'll get him before he hits the water. Another nice living legend. Oh, here we go. We got a couple bots right here. Let's see if we can't get rid of them. Diego is back. Let's see if we can't give his Mars a little love here. Oh, he's got the uh, acid weapons right there. Those are actually, in their day, they were pretty vicious. 
And in a close range brawl, that's not that's not a bad alternative. It's just not going to stand up to this. All right, let's go ahead and get down here. Let's go ahead and cap their beacon again. Oh, I got hammered by the Ophian. Nice. It's built-in weapon. That works. Let's go ahead and drop the second Ocho. Now, I am going to be uh, in 9.6. We do have a couple new pilots coming out. One is for a Titan, the new Titan that's coming out. And then we're going to have a new bot with a new Titan. Or, excuse me, a new pilot that... And that's going to be rather interesting. And then we're going to get the new pilot for the Fenrir. So I've banked up. I've got like close to 30,000 Memoriam banked up. And I'm probably going to see if I can't push it to 40,000 uh, by the time 9.6 drops. Because I'm going to need it because I that new pilot, I think, is going to make the Ocho very, very potent again. Uh, instead of having lots of hit points, it's going to have defense points, but they cannot be mitigated. So it means it's going to be able to brawl with Titans again. And that is going to be fantastic. And along with the new weapons, the heavy version of the Damper. That is going to be a monster. It's going to be a monster, monster bot. All right, let's go ahead and work on Sky. Man, no one is getting beacons here. And we're down to three players. So it's just kind of, yeah, it's just kind of in survival mode now. Let's just see if we can't take out a bot or two more. I mean, we did an aggressive spawn point raid. We pushed in. We took their home beacon. We've taken the center beacon twice at least. Um, but that that was a, a brutal match, guys. I mean, absolutely brutal. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the scores real quick, and then uh, then we'll hop out of here. Ooh, I'm going to watch myself a video. Alrighty, guys, here we go. Quick tail of the tapes. 11 million, and I didn't even drop a Titan. One assist, 16 kills. Four beacon caps. Wow, what a pounder. Alrighty, let's just go ahead and take a look here. Um, I can see where we lost it already. Uh, let's go ahead and bring out the Madden pen here. Uh, what we got here is low beacon. Any place I'm seeing, let's go ahead and clear that. Any place I'm seeing a zero or a one, that is what, that is, that's what really contributes to the loss there, guys. You look over on the other side, there are no zeros in the kills or beacon category, whereas we have over here one, two in the kill category. We got ones in the kill category. We got ones in the beacon cap, and we got a two down there in the beacon cap as well. But that two is actually in a linear map is a little more acceptable. But we had, you know, we had a lot of zeros and ones right there, and that don't spell victory. And you can't carry it all yourself. I got four beacons. 16 kills, I mean, I did my best to bot the other team out, but it just wasn't going to happen. Alrighty, guys, uh, I think that's going to be a wrap up here. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell for notifications. That way, you know when I'm dropping it. Alrighty, guys, stay safe and healthy. Watch out for each other. I'll catch you on the battlefield.